Deep communion with Jesus Christ is the mother of all supernatural discoveries and recoveries. Resident in the Word of God is the answer to every man's questions. This is the season of darkness over sinners. It does not matter for how long you have been a churchgoer. Without Jesus, you are hopeless. Sin is a sinker of glory. Stop living in sin. God loves you beyond your widest imagination. He does not want you to perish. Come to Jesus today. The reason Jesus hung on the cross is for him to destroy the works of the devil in your life. And not for the works of the devil to destroy you. Faith, what sort of message was that? I don't understand. Sir. Come on! Keep short! You don't understand what? Was that the kind of stupid and senseless message we invited you here to come and preach? Jesus. Your message was too harsh on the audience. Jesus. I mean, you turned the whole service into a graveyard morning service. Jesus. You spoke as if you don't commit sin. If I preach like that, do you think you will come here and meet anyone here? After all, are we not all sinners? Look, you dwelled too much on the issues of sin and holiness. Just imagine. Virtually everybody came out for the altar call and they were weeping. They were crying like babies, they were sobbing. And that made nonsense of the uh, offering. I mean, look after you finish preaching. Many of them still couldn't dip their hands into their pocket to bring that offering. Can you imagine that? I mean, do you know how much it cost me to gather that crowd together? The crowd you came and embarrassed with your sorrowful message. Jesus. <sighs> and if you don't know, that kind of message you preached wasn't the kind of message that will be influenced by the Holy Spirit. Jesus did not call us to come and preach a message of horror and sorrow. He did it. My God. Rubbish. Now, faith. Sir. Without any apology, you are a mistake. Jesus. Yes. In fact, I made a very terrible mistake by allowing the youth wing of this church to invite you here to come and preach. Yes, I made a grievous mistake. <sighs> Will you keep quiet? Look, I don't even want to see you again. Get out of this office. Get out of this place. Sir, here's the honorarium for the evangelist. Give the damn thing to him and let him get out of this place. Jesus. Faith, get out of this place. Leave! I said you should leave! Rubbish. Oh! Welcome, dear. <laughs> dear, what is it? How was the administration? What is wrong? Everything. Everything is wrong with me. God, why is the so-called oil of grace that you have placed upon my head getting me into troubles all the time. <sighs> My God. I don't understand anymore. Uh -uh. God. 
you asked me to speak your message as you give me utterances without fear or favor of anyone. You want me that I should never treat your word for sheer emotional outbursts. But this keeps fighting back against me. Yeah, please stop this. Yeah, please stop. Oh my God. Honestly, I am fed up. I don't think I can continue with this. Ah, uh, you will continue on it. My dear, in Jesus' name, you will continue. Ah, it's a matter of time. If it is God who sent us, ah, the impact will speak and Jesus will be glorified. Hold on. Wait. Oh my God. What? what? The Holy Spirit just told me that he's the landlord. So? Ah, we owe him. Yes, I know. Ah. Dear, please. Please. Tell him that I'm not around. Ah. But why? That's a lie. Daddy, <laughs> you are welcome, sir. Thank you. I can't bother, sir. You. <laughs> you are welcome, sir. Is, is your husband around? <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank God. You mean he's inside? Um, uh, no, no, sir. He's not in, no. Oh, my God. I thought you said yes. Oh, I meant to say no, sir. I I'm sorry about that, sir. Uh, no problem. Uh, uh, no problem. I, I believe you. Huh? And I need to see him urgently. Sir, please, for God's sake, please, be more patient with us. We shall settle all our debt very soon, very soon, by God's grace. Uh, no, no, madam. Please stand up. I'm not here for that. I never knew your husband is such a powerful man of God. I, I, I was... Please, sir, please have your seat, sir. Thank you. <laughs> I was there at the cathedral where I was invited to preach this morning. Wow. I've never been so how empty I was without Jesus. I will forever be grateful to your husband for showing me the love of Jesus and the emptiness of a life without Jesus. You see, I gave my life to Jesus in that program and I'm here to tell your husband that my family is ready for Jesus. Please tell him as soon as he comes back that he should call me. I'm really itching to hear more of God's word through him. God bless you. But the groundnut is very sweet. Uh -uh.
Yes. Yes, please come in. Good day, sir. Good day, gentlemen. You are welcome. Thank you, um, sir. Please, what can we do for you? Sir, you are Evangelist Fitz. I don't write by me. Is your dollar? Yes, I, I am. Okay, we are from your friend, Apostle Jude Adams. Ah, sorry. Do you mean Jude Adams of uh, Melody Ministry? Yes, sir. It's been a very long time that um, we heard from each other. Is Jude an apostle now? Yes, sir. We are men of his protocol team. He has mandated us to come all the way from Lagos to deliver this invitation to you in person. That's very thoughtful of him. Glorious God. Dedication of a mega cathedral? New set of ultra modern state of the heart musical equipment? New choir ropes? 15 new coaster buses? Yes, sir. Actually, the coaster buses are now 25 by divine providence. Masotaya! Prakasita Gaya! This is. Wait. Is this the picture? Of the new cathedral? Yes, sir. This is big. Mm. This is, is awesome. I mean, it's fantastic. Sir, Apostle said he tried calling your number several times, but it was not reachable. Did you change your number, sir? Um, no. Please, sit down. No, thank you. We're okay. Uh, no, not really. Uh, actually, I, I still use the same number, just that um, the phone has some issues. You see, the charging point um, is 40, so <laughs> I've been offline for some days now. Meanwhile, I still have Jude's number. I will contact him as soon as I fix the phone. This is 100,000 Naira. He said this is a token for your recharge card, sir. Huh? Jesus Christ. Uh, Hundred thousand naira token for the charge cards. Oh my god. Yes, sir. Ha. Ah. Jesus. Amen. My God, we continue to bless him. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Sir. Ah. If we are permitted, we would like to take on. Ah, no, 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 no. Please, don't go yet. Hey, let, let me get you some water, please. Yeah. Don't bother, ma. Thank you. God bless you. Oh. I wish you a very safe trip, pleasant trip, back to Lagos. Amen. Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> let me see them. Let me see them. God, what exactly is wrong with me? What am I not getting right? Where am I missing it?
What has happened to you? Why did you decide to waste? Why did you choose to close your mind to the realities of amazing supernatural manifestations? <laughs> I see. You're waiting. <laughs> waiting on God, huh? <laughs> May I disappoint you? Those who engage in such waiting only end up becoming failures. Meaning in life and ministry does not just happen. You make it happen. A, a, a man who claims to, to wait for God will only waste his life. You need not to wait again because he has made all things yours. Entry into an era of everyday majestic winning is not by struggles, but by divine impartation. You think it's um, by, by oh, your holiness or by, by how much uh, fasting you can subject your poor self to? I doubt it, bro. Look at you. You are shrinking already. You don't look good at all. I even learned that um, you hold your church service in a rented or completed old building. Ah! You're not representing my Jesus well. If becoming successful in life and ministry is a function of how holy a man is, you will not be here begging to know this, the, the, the secret to my exploits in life and ministry. Faith. Permit me to say it the way it is. You are wasting. Most of our colleagues that the world celebrates now, they met you in ministry. In fact, you were our teacher back then. But we are better off today simply because you think it's still better to follow the old drugged path. <laughs> the man of God who is following the path of the old drugged cross. <laughs> Faith Adora gave me your dollar. If you must manifest God's kind of glory and splendor, then you must climb on the shoulders of the elders of faith. The divine impartation for unimaginable exploits that you have talked so much about is a reality. And it is what you need. You see, as I said, Jesus is peace. Jesus is life. Please keep it. Okay? I'll tell you. I've been waiting in front of your door for the past one hour. I knocked severally, but no one answered. And I know that that your wife and son are inside. But they refused to answer me because they knew I was the one knocking. <laughs> Daddy, what is wrong with you? Can't you wait for me to be true with the bike man before saying all this? I have waited enough. My mother has refused to give me money for my evening classes. She said she budgeted using the money you are holding her to pay for my extra moral evening classes, but you have refused to pay her. Ah. Now, my exams is fast approaching. My mates are presently in class receiving lectures, but you have denied me of that opportunity hey, hey. because of your prolonged inability to pay for the full stuff you begged that to give you on credit. Jesus. Ah. Dare. Don't dare me, Joe. I don't even know the kind of pastor you are, sir. My father, who is a drunkard, is better off than you because he only goes around drinking himself to stupor and running after small, small girls. At least it's better than being a pastor who goes around begging. Ah! Jesus Christ. Man of God. Ah. Please come and pay your debt. I don't want to keep sitting at home doing nothing like your son. Ah, my father. Hey, my father. Ah, Daddy. <laughs> ha. Baba. <laughs> I 
And Jesus, being full of the Holy Ghost, returned from Jordan and was led by the Spirit into the wilderness. Being forty days tempted of the devil, and in those days he did eat nothing. And when they were handed, he afterward hungered. And the devil said unto him, If thou be the Son of God, command this stone that it be made bread. And Jesus answered him, saying, It is written that thou shalt not live by bread alone, but by every word of God. And the devil, taking him up on a high mountain, showed unto him all the kingdoms of the world in a moment of time. Hmm. And the devil said unto him, All the power will I give thee, and the glory of them, for that is delivered unto me, and to whomsoever I will I give it. Hmm. If thou therefore will worship me, all shall be thine. And Jesus answered and said unto him, Get thee behind me, Satan, for it is written, Thou shalt worship the Lord thy God, and him only shall thou serve. Hmm. Hmm. My son, it is true, you have prayed so hard on all sides. But be careful, be very careful. Don't be another Esau. Done for the sake of a morsel of meal of vanity, bow in worship to the hack enemy of your precious soul. Mm. 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 Your relationship with Jude is not of God. Mm. My son, there is a set time for every man. Wait for your time. Wait for it. Tis so sweet to trust in Jesus, just to take him at his word, just to rest upon his promise, just to Says the Lord, says so sweet to trust this is Jesus. You. I recognize you. <laughs> oh, you think you can use the image of the Holy Spirit, my senior partner, to deceive me? You want to separate me? For my destiny, help again. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no. No way. You cannot stop my progress anymore. No. It will not happen. It will not happen. Well done, my brother. Thank you so much, sir. Uh, actually, I know you may not know me, but I, I know you very well. As a matter of fact, we in the neighborhood know you to be a genuine man of God. Yeah. And I pray God will continue to bless you and bless your ministry. Amen. Thank you. <laughs> I am Mr. King, the Chief Executive Officer of Ayela Begon Investments. Oh. I also own No Cracks Block Industry very close by. Ah, praise God. Praise God. Um, see, I bought a car just about two months ago okay. and about a week ago uh, God instructed me to mm. come and give you the car and that is why mm. I am here huh? yes sir God instructed me to give you the car sir ah. <laughs> you mean God asked you to give a car to me yes sir Ah, Jesus, you are real. Thank you, Jesus. 
Uh, my brother, God bless you. Amen, sir. I appreciate you so much. God bless you. Amen, sir. Yeah, uh, if you won't mind, sir, I right. would like to show you some of the operations of the car. Ah, no problem. Why not? No problem. <laughs> okay, I appreciate sir. you. <laughs> God bless you. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, this is the vehicle. <laughs> yeah, the, this is the key, and uh, sir, please come. Um, the first, sir, come along, sir. <laughs> yeah, the first operation I need to show you about the car is, sir, you. You cannot open the driver's side unless you open this side first. And this side, you have to hold it, pull it up and open it. Then don't allow this one to close back before you open the driver's side. Or else, you may not be able to open the other side. So, then I, excuse me. Then from there, you would open this side then you can now close that other one. Uh, but then, sir, you have to kick twice or uh, times, three times before it will, I will demonstrate it. Um, ah, please, come in, sir. Let me show you. Okay, no problem. Um, okay. Faith before we enter. For any man who desires to succeed in life, there comes a time when he has to make a major decision out of desperation. Now, see, this is the temple of the elders of faith. This is where impartation happens. Now, your entrance into this holy temple will give you an an, an a, a lifetime opportunity that will automatically make you an elder in the race of life. Ah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Honestly, Jude, I, I must tell you this, that I'm already having a feeling of God's presence here. <laughs> I assure you, I assure you, it, it, it's an encounter of a lifetime. As a matter of fact, the only elders are highly beloved fathers of faith mm. who are graciously ordained by God Almighty, you know, with uncommon power. See, their intervention saved my ministry, which was um, almost fading fast in shame. Mm. But you see, here we are now. <laughs> I can see. Yeah, I can see. So, let, let's go in. Let's go in. <sighs> Thank you, Jude. I'll forever be grateful to you. Miaskata, Miaskoto, Mikalu. Miaskata, Miaskoto, Mikalu. Miaskata, Miaskoto, Mikalu. Miaskata, Miaskoto, Mikalu. 
Miaskata, Miaskoto, Mikalu. Miaskata, Miaskoto, Mikalu. Master, here is a searching soul, a child of God who is ready to cross beyond the veil of deception and become enlightened. Faith, Adora Agbe Mi Jodola, is here. Ready to submit his soul to the supreme ruler. I will not speak for faith. Rather, he shall by himself tell this caucus why he is here. Thou certain soul, why are you here? Impartation, sir. I need divine impartation for great breakthrough and total turnaround. I have suffered so much. Shame and ridicule in life and ministry. I am backward in everything and I fail at all things. Ah, sir, just imagine. Jude and I were ordained into the ministry same day a few years ago. But today we cannot be compared. Why it glows with glory, honor, power, dominion and authority. I am doomed with great struggles, sweating and sorrow. Ha! Ah, elders, please help me. Please help me. I need the very undeniable results that Jude's ministry is known for. Please help me. Bishop Nugo! Shut your mouth. Sorry, sir. Only a fool says everything he knows or sees. According to the word of the Lord, as you have spoken in my ears, so will I do unto you, saith the Lord. Your request for impartation is hereby granted. Ah, praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Step forward to receive the Holy Communion. Eat the flesh of the master. Today, as you partake of his flesh and of his blood, you have entered into an eternal covenant with our master. <clears throat> you have now become an holy elder. And listen very well. 
An elder does not live without instructions. We pray in the name of Jesus. Yes, we do. But the name of Jesus has limitations. There are things the name of Jesus alone cannot do. We also pray using the name of Master Jam. Master Jam is the sacred name of the Most High God. With the name of Master Jam, there is no limitation. So whenever you are praying or during your times of devotion, yes, the name of Master Jam to worship. Is that okay? Now, an elder is not permitted to sleep in the same room with a woman. It is an abomination. Your soul does not belong to you any longer. Your soul now belongs to our Lord and Master, Master Jam. You have, all your whole volition, relinquished your soul to our Lord and Master, Master Jam. Lekusa Tukaju Miaskata Miaskoto Mikalu In the mighty name of Master John, we have prayed. Amen. Precious, God bless you. Amen. Go to your room. God bless you. Yeah. This master jam of your thing. Hey, please, don't go there again. You see, what you have failed to realize these days is that the move of the Holy Spirit on me these days is so strange. So strange and wholesome. So strange that the same way he moves you to pray in the Holy Ghost, during which you speak speak in some unknown tongues. He also moves me to pray in a secret name. Ah. Yes, there. In fact, recently, I had to caution the Holy Spirit that I don't want to pray in the name again. But he enlightened my mind. He said to me that the name is a privileged secret name that works mighty wonders. He enlightened my mind further that according to the ancient scroll found in the depths of the Dead Sea several decades ago, Master Jam is the original interpretation of the Latin word that means Jehovah Almighty. That name is not an ordinary name. It is working for us already. Ah, the only highly exalted name I know is the name of Jesus. And not Master Jam. Uh, anyway, you see, since you don't agree with the use of the name, I will stop it. The Holy Spirit does not even permit me to use the name publicly. It is for my private consumption. All right? Good night. Ah, uh, what are you doing here? What am I doing with? Haven't I told you that for now, we will not be sleeping together in the same room? And I said I don't understand. Of course I know. You can't understand. Because there is nothing there for you to understand. Woman! No more sleeping together in the same room for now. Not in this house. That won't happen in this house. <laughs> uh.
Jesus, what is happening to us, Lord? What is wrong, God? Nothing. Nothing is wrong anywhere anymore. Not again. So what about all these changes? What is the reason behind all these strange developments? Hmm. Hmm. Spiritually, everything was wrong with us. Of course you know. You know how many families we used to go to on a constant basis to beg for food. We begged for food. We begged for clothes. We begged for every good and essential things of life. <laughs> but now that we are more enlightened and better with the help of God and Apostle Jude who got us this place. I need to keep up the flow as the headship of this home. This is what the Holy Spirit wants me to do. The Holy Spirit is calling me aside from all distractions. The same way he called Moses aside for a very personal, special, spiritual programs. So is that the reason why you are asking me to move out of our bedroom to another? Now, tell me what is that very special, personal, spiritual exercise that your wife can't engage in with you? Oh, am I a distraction now? You see, these are your reasons, these your excuses are not tying together. They are not strong enough. Please, just tell me now! God. Move to the other room, period! Get out! Get out! Need only heathers See only heathers They seem to worship God Hello, Senator Hackman Huh? Okay Alright, alright, alright Don't worry, don't worry Let me pray with you my Father and my God, the Lord over my life, I pray that the case your son has will be scattered in his favor. Yes, I don't care to know what actually happened, but whatever needs to happen for the court case to be settled in his favor, let it happen. Yes, in the name of Jesus. If you to take my Lord for you to waste lives in order for him to win, please do not hesitate to waste them. Let him come back and testify. Turn him into a terror. Yes. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Don't, don't, don't worry. Just rest your mind. It is settled. All right. God bless you. Bye-bye. Madam, I've heard everything you said. You see, mm, the fact that your husband now prays in a name you're not familiar with does not mean he's backsliding or he's in error. It is you that I will advise to get more spiritual with the things of the kingdom so that you can gain access to deep things of the kingdom. Do you understand? Accept it from me today. Deep mysteries abound in the kingdom. And then doesn't the Bible say that um, love believes all things? So why is it difficult for you to believe it? Anyways, I was um, touching the fact that uh, you people sleep in separate rooms. If your husband desires to be closer to God, let him. Your husband is a set man of a ministry. He's not a baby in the things of God. He's an elder. So if he decides that um, from today, no woman will sleep in the same room with him, then leave him. Ah. Uh -uh. What? I don't get you, sir. Ah. Uh -uh. You don't get what? Sir, am I just a woman to him or his wife? <laughs> you are both. After all, a wife is a woman. Eh? Mm.
faith Adurabimi Ijaudola was one of the genuine sons of the highly exalted one. He was beloved of the Almighty and has caused so much havoc on our kingdom. But now he is falling into our trap. So waste no time on his case. Our master labored so hard to get him. Now that we have him, he is down. He must be destroyed. Yes, your wise one. So, waste no time on his case. Organize his destruction. Yes, wise one. Immediately. Yes, wise one. Need only heavens. See only heavens. They seem to worship God. But refuse to let God walk in them. Meet holy heavens. See holy heavens. You better run away from them. Good day, sir. Good day. Please sit down. Yeah, thank you, sir. Sir, it seems you no longer recognize me again. I'm sorry. I really can't pick this face again. You know, I see several people on a daily basis. <sighs> My wife and I came to you about two months ago. We told you then that we've been married for 12 years without any child of our home. After we tabled our whole day, that day, you did not pray, sir. You only spoke in the Holy Ghost. That in the name of the Most High, my wife shall consent that same month. You are Mr. Akoni? From Senator Bolade in Abuja. Y yes, sir. Oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> ah, sorry, 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 sorry. It has happened, sir. Oh my God. My shame is gone. My wife is pregnant. The word of Jehovah, our master, does not fall to the ground. Pasu takayabali in the next seven months, your wife shall be delivered of a set of twins. Both boys. His fame has gone beyond description. Wonders. Very stupefying wonders are now characteristic of his ministry. Of course, he's advancing in charisma. But I perceive strongly in my spirit that something is wrong with him. I am not releasing my husband to the manipulations of the devil. No. Faith Adurak Bemi Jaudola. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that the gates of hell shall not prevail over your spirit. It shall not prevail over your soul. It shall not prevail over your body. In the mighty name of Jesus. Rainbow Sota Lika Yebobo. Rainbow Sota Lia Baba Seke Teyem Boluda. Present cast up, deceiving us, love, perhaps of the most high, rooting souls to die. So the double cross should be the reward. Yeah. What? I'm not happy. Not happy? Why? Your attitude these days. Yeah, you have changed. 
things you don't do before, you now do them without any check in your spirit. Yes. Ever before now, I've seen God's power move mightily through you in unquestionable ways. But now it bothers me that it no longer matters to you to tell lies of miracles that do not happen anyway and you still mention my name as a witness. Stop it, woman! Ah. Do you know the implication of what you have just said on my reputation? I don't care again, sir! Any reputation that the evil cannot attest to is fake! It's self-deception! Your eternity matters to me more than any self-acclaimed reputation. Stop it, woman! You're going too far. You don't talk to a man of God like that. Do you want to get yourself killed? Jesus. Guess my Prophet Fee. Mm -hmm. His tone around was very dramatic. He seems to be the reigning man of God in town now. You need to see his church. Have you been there? Mm -hmm. Kai! Come and see crowd. Crowd! People! Hell! So what is the secret of his sudden and dramatic turn around? Well, I don't know. I don't I don't know, but I just feel it's his time. I think he's just favored, you know? And this man, I used to know him when he was very poor. Very poor. A pauper. Ah! Only I have a very strong feeling that something has gone wrong with him. No, my dear, no, no, no. I don't, I don't think so. This man is sound. He's a sound Christian. I used to know him very well. He's a sound Christian with sound messages. And I think he's even really anointed and very prayerful. Ah, no. Don't say that, my dear. Don't even say that. No, let's despise this man. Seriously, I just think that is his time. And after all, God answers prayers. So, I think God has answered his own prayers. We just need to connect with his God by faith. And we will be favored like him. All right. Them speak church language. Services were parking with paparazzi. Just how loud we can feel. That is the urgent request from Master Jam. It seems you're so healthy to be acting fit for a thing like this. He must sacrifice his son. Precious is his only child. A child gotten after eight years of childless marriage. <laughs> That's purely emotional. And in the things of the spirit, emotion has no place. Faith must sacrifice his only son and he must divorce his wife. That woman has become an impurity in the life of faith and she must be removed in order to preserve his ministry. This is a thing of the spirit and it does not always make sense in the physical. Faith is still a baby in the things of the kingdom. If we have questions, and we will answer them all. Faith, be a man. Jude, I really don't understand. I, 
I don't understand. This is a group, a holy group, comprising of men with heavy anointing and grace. Mm -hmm. I mean, men with deep understanding of deep secrets. Mm -hmm. Yes, I know. Mm. I know. Mm. But why is this kind of a request coming from amongst us? Jude, mm? why do I have to make such a sacrifice? And you know about precious. You know for how many years I waited. Mm. Yeah. <sighs> I, I know about precious. And I know it took you eight years to have him, you know. But you see, the ways of God are beyond knowing. His judgment is unsearchable. You see, didn't he ask uh, Prophet Hosea to marry a harlot? And then Jephthah's um, daughter in um, Judges 11, she was sacrificed. And he accepted it. I mean, didn't he accept it? Who are we to question the will of the Almighty? It, it, is, it is a great privilege to sacrifice to him. Yes. Yes. But this doesn't seem to be right now. Stop it, Faith. Stop it. You are an elder. You are not a baby. Ah, you see, every elder has passed through this stage at one time or the other. It's called uh, the stage of sacrificial offering. All friends of God must pass through it. Abraham did. Ah, did no? No? Abraham did it, but Abraham did not sacrifice Isaac. Uh, uh, of course, of course, of course. However, he, he, he started the process. He did it in his heart. He, um, Hebrews 11 should, should have said, um, by faith, Abraham sacrificed Isaac. He started the process. Uh, maybe um, this is um, a test for you to, it will be a test of your love and faith to the great Master John. <sighs> no. My God. You have to be strong. Hmm? You are an elder. You have to be strong. This is difficult. You have to be strong. Another one will come. Precious. Another one will come. Another one will come. Uh, and then, um, Faith, there is uh, one more thing. Your wife is an unholy alliance with you. And she's not spiritually compatible with you. So the transition of precious to glory will offer a great opportunity to get rid of her. Jude. Hmm. Get rid of her? Hmm. Well, um, I can just lay claim to the fact that um, she's a witch who killed um, Precious, and then you can divorce her. Simple. Mm. Which is well. Um, you see, um, Faith, you may not understand all this now, but um, these are sacred instructions which um, you cannot afford to disobey. Faith. Just to be precious. It's okay. It's okay. <sighs> you, you mean all these for evangelist faith? Yes, all for prophet faith. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, excuse me. Please, what do you do for a living? Oh, um, I, I'm into um, internet exploration, um, internet business. Yes, internet business. Yes, that's what I do. Oh, 
You think that sum is too much for prophet faith? Oh no, 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 no. That sum is not too much. Because those EFCC guys did not take it easy with me at all. I was almost in jail. If not for prophet, who affirmatively declared I shall escape. And I did. Now, I'm a free man. I can't explain how it happened. Jesus. Internet exploration? Yes. Internet exploration. Internet business. Precious, why are you not in bed? I want to be with you. You want to be with me? Yes, Daddy. Precious, you can't be with me. It's too late in the night. All right? All right, Dad. God bless you. I love you, Dad. I love you too. God bless you. Amen. Precious. Good night. Kata, Mias Koto, Mikalu, Mias Kata, Mias Koto, Mikalu, Fate, a drag baby, Ijao Dollar. May I invite you to present on this altar your son, precious. Drag baby, it's our dollar. Hi, Faith. I drag with me, it's our dollar. The father of precious, it's our dollar. Hereby presents you, precious. I drag with me. Ijao Dola to be slaughtered on this halter to our master. Precious Ijao Dola, I am your father. Today I sacrifice you to our master. Mias Kata, Mias Koto, Mikalu. Mias Kata, Mias Koto, Mikalu. Precious Jandola, I am your mother. You were carried in my womb for nine months. You shall not die, but live in the mighty name of Jesus. Precious. Ijao Dollar. Now I release you 
to the Lord over my soul. Son away. I command you in the name of Jesus, lose your grip over him. Ah, ah, what? Ah, 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 Mascata, Mioscoto, Mioscoto, Mikalu, Mioscata, Mioscoto, Mikalu, Ah, abomination, abomination, abomination. What have you brought here? This is an abomination. You have brought an abomination here. Mioscata, Mioscoto, Mikalu. Bishop, is it true? Yes, it is. The two of them did not survive the attack we had at the temple last night. My God. What is this? I don't understand. Honestly, You this jobless man. Ah, haven't I warned you that you should never come here again? Oh, you want to read another verse of sadness and sorrow to me from that your stupid scroll? <laughs> Not again. No way. Now get out. Mark chapter 8 verse 36. Jobless man. If you dare me, I will take that your stupid scroll from you. I will tear it into shreds right in your presence. Now get out! Now get out! Mark chapter 8 verse number 36. The word of God says, Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Stand up! Get out! Get out! Get out! Don't want to see you here again. Get out of this place! Yes, come in. Sir, Pastor Bukoye desires to see you. Huh? Baba Bukoye? Yes, sir. What for? I hate seeing that man. He must have come with a bad name.
All right. All right. Let him come in. All right, sir. Baba, you did not inform me of your coming. What if I was not in the country? Hmm. He knows you are right. Who? The one who sent me here. Who? The Holy Spirit, of course. He said there is a very fierce war going on against your soul and that you are on the verge of packing up. If you don't quickly run back to Jesus, destruction looms. He said, whose shall this empire for which you have placed your soul on the altar of the devil be after you are gone? Mark 8.36 Enough! Enough! No, it is not enough. You drove him. Yes, you drove him away. But you cannot drive me. Mark 8.36 The Bible says, For what shall it profit a man if he gains the whole world and lose his own soul? Evangelist Faith, please come back home. Everything a man needs for life and godliness is in Jesus. I want to assure you, your Savior is still waiting. As powerful as Master Jam is, his agenda was frustrated by the mention of Jesus' name. Instead of precious Ijadola to die, Bishop Jogu and Prophet Amara were given this change. Are we not just a bunch of desperate men who couldn't wait for God's determinate counsel? If an ordinary woman can achieve such a feat with the name of Jesus, are we not just deceiving ourselves? Is this holy elder thing not a scam? Is this holy elder thing not a scam? Says who? Who says it's a scam? Bishop, why are you talking this way? Are you out of your senses? Yes. Yes, and I know I am out of my senses. Because when I was with my senses, I landed myself in this nonsense called Master Jam. I bowed to the deceit of Master Jam out of the fear of the unknown. What has come over you? I'm afraid you're playing with fire. Liar. Liar. There is no more fire. What fire is there? All the fires that were there have been quenched by the mention of the name of Jesus. Jude, there is no more fire. Ah, we shall see. That is an empty threat. That is an empty threat, nothing more. Let a drag be me down, dollar. You are a child of God. You are a son of the Most High God. I release your soul to Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, I stand upon the word of God. I stand upon the authority of the living God. I decree the gates of hell shall be. Send up. Jesus. Jesus. You witch. Never in your life mention my name in your witchcraft prayers again. Oh, you think I don't know of your attempt? 
to keep precious, you have just 30 minutes to leave this building. If I come back and I meet you here, I will kill you with my bare hands. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus! <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Uh, sir, we are the representatives of the Central Planning Committee for the annual conference of uh, PADM. You mean uh, um, Pentecostal Association of Dynamic Ministers? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> ah, you're welcome, my <laughs> Thank you, sir. You're most welcome. Thank, Thank you, sir. very much, sir. And, sir, this year's edition of PADM National Ministers Conference tagged the Hera of the Holy Spirit mm. is around the corner. As such, we have honestly sought the face of God in a recently concluded marathon program mm. uh, as touching who to invite as the main speaker. And thank God. We really thank God. Because the Holy Spirit told us that you are the vessel he has prepared to use for the program, sir. Oh. Praise God, praise God, praise God. Praise God. <laughs> By the way, when, when is the program? Uh, actually, it's going to take place between 28th and 30th of January, this coming year, sir. Mm, 28th to 30th of January. Anyway, I will ask my PA to look into it and then get back to you. Right. And um, I will also see to what I can do to support the program financially. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Please let me bless you. Kapro Zeteke Lepro Shatagayaba. May my God bless you. In Jesus' name we are prayed. Amen. Ah, you remember the Bible says. Wherefore, let him that thinks he stands take heed lest he fall. <sighs> that a man is famous and is doing exploits is not synonymous to divine presence. Uh -uh. Samson was long gone into errors when he was still moving the city gate uphill. We should understand, we should know we should realize that that devil on daily basis the arch enemy of our souls which is war not ordinary war fierce war against our faith therefore this prayer continues until we are able to conquer the devil that is waging war against our brother please and please we should not rest until we are able to achieve our goal. Let us continue this prayer. In the name of Jesus. Father, 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 this brother. Lord Jesus, I gave my life to you about 25 years ago. I was very fervent. And I preached your kingdom to all that I came across. But then, I backed out. The love of the world made me back out. The pressures from within and the pressures from without. The heavy pressures the devil placed upon me. I submitted my soul to him in exchange for perishable pleasures of the world. <sighs> Is it still possible for you to forgive me? Is it possible for you to take me back? <gasps> yes. It dies today. 
who faith aduragbemi ijaudola mm. hmm. yes that is the order of master jam foolish one or what did you call yourself no one dies today faith aduragbemi ijaudola will not die Abomination! What has come over you? How dare you challenge the order of the great master Jah? Oh, come on, stop it! Stop the deception! Master Jah is fake! How come? How come? If indeed Master Jah is the most high, how come he bowed at the name of Jesus? He chickened out. He chickened out at the mention of the name of Jesus when he lost two of the souls under his care. I renounce Master John. He is not the Lord over my soul. Go tell Master John that even if the Lord Jesus Christ will not accept me back, I will forever declare the Lord Jesus Christ, master over my soul. I know I will die, but even in my death, I will still declare the Lord Jesus, master, over my life, over my soul, Jesus remains my God. Whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Faith, Adura Bimi, Ijaudola, dies today. Make it a joint mission. Let it be done fast. This is an order from the Supreme Ruler. Master John, it is done. In Jesus' name, we are afraid. The Lord. The Holy Spirit ordered us now that we should set out to Evangelist Faith House without any delay. Uh, Sister Joyce, please stay with Precious while the rest of us will set out to Evangelist Faith House as ordered by the Holy Spirit. Please, let us go.
sort of nonsense it is. Now, what could be wrong with this car now? Eh? What sort of question are you, are, you, are you asking? I mean, what sort of question is that? What do you mean? You asking me what I mean? It's only a fool that, go, that goes out with a car. He doesn't, he doesn't know the condition with which it is. It is. Yes! Do you realize you have just called me a fool? You knew the condition of this vehicle before you brought it out. And you know how urgent our mission is. And so that's why you call me a fool. Look, I take an exception to that. Because you, you don't have to blame me for this. Why wouldn't I, I blame you? I, I, might do, I might the maker of the engine. That you are not the maker does not mean you should not know the state of your vehicle. I see. That's why you reasoning like a chimpanzee. Me? Ch chimpanzee? Yes. Me? Chimpanzee? The way you have just behaved now shows like you belong to the family of the goats. Shogo, you call me a chimpanzee? Yes, that's what you are. That's the way you are reasoning. Then you are a big fool. If I'm a big fool, yes. then you are a big idiot. Not only are you a big fool, but you are also idiotic minded. Who, I, I, I don't wonder, wonder who made you an elder in the first place. The same thing applies to you. The same thing applies I to you. An elder that is insulting somebody who is older than him. Well, we are, you are look, just a fool. I mean, look, look, you, yeah, you are a me. big fool. Yeah, Not only that, you, you have an idiotic mind. If I have an very fine, you see me having an idiotic mind. Yes. Yeah, no, it's because you reason like I very, very In fact, I think you should go and take a bed at the psychiatric hospital. You. You. You should somebody you that should have your head of your bed. Somebody should have your and bed examined. Good. What is wrong with you? Please, no, Baba, don't just keep don't, out of this. Please. Keep out of this. He started in see. You are you are you very an idiot too. Can you imagine call him an idiot? Yes now. Ah, the reason why I was for your information, I have yeah. I have two cars. You have two cars. Huh? Never given me any problem. You have two cars. Yes. Jesus. Who do you even know how you acquired the two cars? I am not ignorant so of the devil's genius. You are. Who is jealous of? If you are not. Satan. See, I disappoint your mission in Jesus' name. And that's why you were. That your point belly doesn't mean you. Join the next car. And where would they recommend? Because it's only the psychiatric. Where would they recommend the best? That 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 would behave like this. You know what I mean. Join the next car. I is it my fault that the car that the car went into this? You've not been taking good care of it. You should remember that person allowed his car to be in this kind of condition before taking it outside. Can you can you see? Can you see can, the way you are talking yes, now? Yes! You are I, not reasoning like a man! I have two cars and it has never given me any Who problem. knows how you even acquired the two cars? That's your, that's Who your knows? business. That's your business. Who knows how you acquired the two that's cars? That's your business. Because a reasonable person will not reason the way you look are reasoning. Look at it. It's you even dirty. You actually understand what you are doing at all. It's even dirty. No, Baba. Master Jam orders your transition to the great beyond. That's death. Shoot. Bishop Lueco. You mean Master Jam wants me dead? Hello, 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 Dr. Edward. I need to see you urgently. Are you in the hospital? All right, I'll be with you in a moment. No, 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 no. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I just want to be on admission, all right? I, yes, I want to be on admission, no problem. Yeah!
that good works of God. Now talk to me. Look at my face. Please look at me, my dear. My daughter, the reason you are here is not to weep. Okay. I can see his spirit leaving his body. Ah, Jesus. Lead him back to the Savior of his soul. Oh. Tell him to profess Jesus now. Tell him to profess Jesus as the Lord over his soul. Do it fast, my daughter. Ah, now, you see, only you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Say something, say something, say something. Please, please. Say it. No, 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 please. This is not the time to say that. Will your mother talk to me? Now look at me. Just look at my face. Look at my face. I say something. Say something. You can say it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. This is not the time to say that. Just just confess. Jesus. I say I'm not. No. You can't do this to me. You cannot die. No, you shall not die. You shall not die. I refuse to surrender in this day. I'm not for your eyes. Oh, for your eyes. Jesus. 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 Damn, thank you, Miss Mouth. Please, come and do something. Come and do it. Come and do it right to me. Come and do it. Ah, do something, Jesus. Thanks, thank you. 